Hey everyone, Ramesh here. Today I'm going to start a new video tutorial series on developing crude full stack application using React and Spring Boot. In this tutorial series, we will learn how to develop a simple full stack web application that is basic employee management application using React and Spring Boot. We are going to use React to develop a single page application and we use Spring Boot to develop RESTful web services. Okay before developing our full stack application let's quickly have a demo what exactly we are going to develop in this video tutorial series all right so look at here this is our user interface of employee management application this is the employees list page here basically a list of employees are listed in this page here we have add employee button so we can use add employee button to add a new employee to the employees list let's go ahead and let's click on add button here we here we go so this is the add employee page through which we can add a new employee let's go ahead and let's add a new employee first name ramesh last name fadatare email id ramesh at the gmail.com and hit save button so this will add a new employee to the employees list let's go ahead and let's quickly add another employee let's say john cena email id john at the gmail.com hit save button here we, go, here we go so we have added two employees to the employees list let's go ahead and let's update one of the employee i'm going to update ramesh employee click on update button and here i will update from ramesh to ram and email id from ramesh at the rate gmail.com to ram at the rate gmail.com and hit save button here we go so the employee is successfully updated now i can use delete button to delete a corresponding employee let us say i'm going to delete a ram employee click on delete button to delete the employee these are the crude functionalities that we are going to develop in this video tutorial series so again look at here this is the header and this is the porter and it in header section we have employees and add employee link we can click on employees link to navigate to the employees list page and we can click on add employee link to navigate to the you know add employee page all right guys now let us take a quick overview of react and spring boot react is used to build user interfaces on the front end so basically react is one of the popular javascript library to develop single page applications and react is not a framework unlike angular react is not a framework it is just a javascript library to build user interfaces okay react is open source project created by facebook all right spring boot is getting more popularity especially for developing restful web services and micro services spring boot has taken spring framework to the next level it has drastically reduced the configuration and setup time required for spring projects you can set up spring project with almost zero configuration and start building the things that actually matter to your application all right guys we are going to use react to develop user interface and spring boot to develop a restful web services okay what you will learn in this video tutorial series you will develop your first full stack application with react and spring boot you will learn the basics of building awesome front-end applications with react you will be introduced to building great restful apis with spring boot basically we are going to develop a crude restful web services with spring boot and we are going to use spring data jpa to develop a repository layer and we are going to use mysql database to store and retrieve the data you will learn how to make a rest api call from react application to spring boot restful api you will learn the basics of react components jsx state and props so we are going to develop a lot of react components and we are going to write a lot of jsx code and we are going to use a component states and props in react application so we will learn a lot of we will learn the basics of react so basically you will develop a employee management full stack application step by step with crude functionalities okay let us take a look at client server architecture at a client side we are going to develop a react application and at the server side we are going to develop spring boot application so spring boot application basically exposes 
crude restful web services and react application will consume restful web services and react is not concerned with http so react has to use third party http library to make a rest api call in our case we are going to use arcgeo's http library to make a rest api call okay great thank you guys for watching feel free to subscribe my youtube channel i will see you guys in the next video